Me googling my ADHD's impact on memory. All the links being purple. Also your ADHD sending me this yesterday lol. SHT. For me, being chill is getting to the airport three hours before takeoff so I can sit in a restaurant directly across from my gate and be anxious about missing my flight from there. Me around animals. Me around people. God knew I would be too powerful if I had an attention span. My brain has many things to hold. And no pockets. ADHD people giving each other advice. There is a bump here, so please watch your step. Me, who just did my chores. When do I get to have DOP in mine? My ADHD brain. That's the neat part, you don't. I was initially planning on being a casual fan, but then I thought, why not just let it consume my soul instead? One of the cruelest things about autistic ADHD masking is that you learn to treat positive emotions as a warning sign that you're about to do something wrong and that it is therefore safest for everyone if you maintain a constant, low-key negative internal emotional state. If you are late diagnosed autistic and or under, you may discover very odd comment being thrown your way that will have you questioning everything. You didn't use to act this autistic ADHD. You'll stop. Look at your actions and wonder, F, am I faking all this because I've been diagnosed? No. No you are not. What you are experiencing, and what they are seeing, is known as unmasking. Diagnosis, for many late diagnosed adults, is a long sought after answer. Before diagnosis we often suppress all our needs, including stimming, hyperactivity, difficulties concentrating, force ourselves to go out socialize, etc. Diagnosis is the first time we feel we have permission to not kill ourselves for the sake of a two-hour dinner party. And we say no, thank you or we stim more to concentrate or cope instead of holding it all in. An NT people see that and say this is different. People don't change unless something is wrong with them. So, something is wrong with what they're doing. But there is nothing wrong with unmasking. It's scary sometimes necessary dot but it is never wrong. I don't post for likes. I post because I have ADHD and if I don't tell someone every thought that comes into my mind I'll die. So, how have you been? Me realizing I exist and people can see me? Me. Some hobby I've hyper fixated on and will surely abandon once I realize I'm not immediately good at it. How do I teach my body that my fight or flight response is supposed to be for life or death situations, not answering an email? Autism. ADHD. I live in constant fear of being asked to share a fun fact about me. Finally figuring out that I'm autistic with ADHD after years of feeling different. Trying to get diagnosed. Yesterday I learned there's a phrase in German meaning I am feeling visited enough that you can say when you want company to go and this is brilliant. ADHD Gothic. You want to watch a movie. You put it on. Two hours have passed. You haven't watched the movie. There are five new tasks in front of you. You want to watch a different movie. There is an object in your hand. It is extremely important you don't lose it. You look down. There is nothing in your hand. You don't know your friend's name. You have been friends for months. I just told you their name. You don't know their name. Your friend doesn't laugh at your joke. Why didn't they laugh? Do they hate you? They assure you otherwise. You know they were lying. Did they ever like you? Someone asks you what you just said. Did you say something? You said so many things. You said nothing. You said everything. There is something you're forgetting. You check. You check again. There is nothing you're forgetting. There is something you're forgetting. You had something to say. You can't remember. It was important. Wasn't it? You can't remember. There is a task that needs to be done. It should take 10 minutes. You check the clock. It's been 5 minutes. You check the clock. It's been 2 days. Shout out to everyone who simply cannot work at an even, steady pace, and instead vacillates between frenzied hyperwork mode and a near-catatonic state of existential dread and avoidance. Nobody.
ADHD people buying yet another planner they won't use. I am no longer mentally ill. Hyperactive ADHD. Inattentive ADHD. Combined. ADHD in adulthood. So you've decided to become isolated and weird. Teacher assessments of ADHD students. Brilliant, but lazy. Other kids' favorite Pixar characters. Elsa, Buzz Lightyear, Lightning McQueen, etc. My autistic has. Teacher, this isn't art class, stop doodling in your book. ADHD students. Being able to teleport must suck as when you have ADHD. Why the F am I in Nevada? Teleports home, immediately remembers why they were going to Nevada. F me. The I don't know how to reply starter pack. Aha, lol. Oh damn, nice. Oh I see. Sending a meme back. Hmm, that's a good idea, I should write that down. My ADHD brain. No, I don't think I will. My ADHD. I think you're overthinking it. My anxiety. I think you're underthinking it. Dot. People. Receives constructive feedback. My ADHD brain. After all dot why not? Why shouldn't I take this personally? Tip for partners, family members of ADHD people. The more you ask us to do something, the less likely we're going to do it. Well now I am not doing it. The main story. Adders. Side quests. Me trying to raw dog life without ADHD medication. Olympic cameraman stopped filming field hockey to focus on a cockroach in the game's final minutes. The whole ADHD community. One of us. Your secret is safe with me. Because I wasn't paying attention. Me choking on my own saliva for no reason. How time feels for an editor when they have to do anything that is remotely uninteresting. One hour here is seven years on earth. Me, should I go for a walk before I shower, or after? ADHD, let's think about it until it's too late to do either. When you wanna sleep but your friend won't stop talking. When you get stuck behind a slow walker. Sometimes I blow on my ice cream before I take a bite. I have no idea why. Brain, food, is very temperature. Also brain, no worry, learned from soup, no what do. This is the tone in which my brain talks about everything. Me holding the thought in my mind, trying not to interrupt the conversation, whilst hoping the topic doesn't change. Sometimes we send this up to HQ for no reason. Toss a coin to your witcher, a valley of plenty. It plays in his head over and over again. Like a million times. She's a 10 but she uses small spoons because big spoons give her bad vibes. Brain fog forces you to substitute words. Look at say. Vibrating midget bird. Warm water tastes round and cold water tastes pointy. Why would you say something so controversial yet so brave? It says you have potential. My teachers. That time I did well in class. Me as an undiagnosed ADHD student. I have learned two very important lessons in my life. I don't remember the first one, but the second one is to write everything down. Thanks so much for watching friends. I hope you've enjoyed this new format of the video with text to speech. If you do, please leave a like so I know if I should keep making more. I also wanted to make sure you knew that starting in February Extramim will be changing its name to the Neurodivergent Adult. We'll still be posting memes but there will also be videos on topics of neurodiversity as an adult, narrated by the channel's ADHD creator and made with the help of her autistic husband. I hope you'll join us for those videos. Thanks again. I hope you have a great year.